Well, hello everyone. I'm here with our dear friend Jane Van Zant. We're actually in Henderson, Kentucky. Hi. We're in the Freebird, what I call the Freebird official office. And uh, Jane's come up uh, from Jacksonville, Florida to, to go into the Branchville Correctional Facility with us here just in a few hours. We're going to be getting ready to leave. <laughs> Jane, say hello for a minute. Hi, everybody. How you doing? I'm happy to be in this room. This is amazing. It's a very, very special room. And we're very happy to have Jane here with us. Uh, it's uh, going to be a surprise to the men that's there tonight to have Jane going in and viewing the Freebird's Last Flight presentation. And uh, we're going to be taking all, everything off the walls just here in a few minutes in order to pack them up and take them to the prison. Let me just show you around. We'll come back to Jane here in a minute. Let me just show you around a little bit. Uh, come with me over this way. First of all, we have some albums over here on the wall. We have Skinner's first album over here called uh, Pronounced. And then uh, up here, we actually have uh, uh, Skinner's first and last album. And this is the gatefold. The inside of the album has many pictures and everything. Uh, and then over here, we have their last album before the plane crash. The Street Survivors album came out October the 17th of uh, 1977. After the plane crash, they took it uh, uh, you know, off the market, and they replaced the cover with a cover without flames, out of respect for the group. And so over here, of course, uh, Jane uh, is uh, in the famous Van Zant family, and uh, she's, of course, uh, the, the cousin to uh, the late Ronnie Van Zant and to the famous Johnny Van Zant and uh, Donnie Van Zant of 38 Special here. This is an album that I had signed uh, when I went to meet with Donnie Van Zant with the help of uh, Jane, got me back to speak with her, her cousin. And then right over here, this here is a, an album, a special advance preview from Leonard Skinner's live album, One More From The Road. This was sent to us by someone anonymous uh, that wanted us to display this in, to prison, and so they sent this to me for the explicit uh, purposes of taking this into the prison. Uh, it actually has all the autographs uh, of the original band members, Ronnie Van Zant being right here. Then you have uh, Alan Collins, Leon Wilkerson, and uh, Cassie Gaines, Billy Powell, just passed away recently. And uh, this here was at the Fox Theater in Atlanta, Georgia. This was a, uh, this is a live recording, so all the pictures are pertaining to the Fox Theater. Down here is just some pictures of me and some of the band members, Johnny Van Zant, Skinner, and me and uh, my wife Joanne, and my son David with Donnie Van Zant 38 Special, Jane's brother, uh, Jimmy Van Zant, and me down in Nashville, and this is just a little picture that we took uh, at the Opry Mills uh, Mall down in Nashville just a couple months ago when we went down to have lunch with Jimmy Van Zant, his wife Z, of course Joanne, myself, and Jane, and one of Jane's friends, Janet. Up here on the wall over here is the, an album, One More From The Road. Over to the left of that album is a, an original San Diego Union uh, newspaper from the day after the crash. And it says there are three rock band stars killed in air crash. We'll be taking that into the prison this, uh, as well. Over here on the shelf, here's a uh, special poster that Jimmy Van Zant uh, gave to us just a couple months ago. It says, the Barry and family, the Van Zant family, gives our love and blessings to yours. Keep the faith, Jimmy Van Zant. Down here, just a few various uh, Leonard Skinner items. Over here behind uh, Jane, we got a couple more albums here. Uh, Leonard Skinner, Give Me Back My Bullets, and their second album here, uh, Second Helping. Then up here above the closet here, we have some just uh, Johnny Van Zant picture I took myself in concert. And uh, he says up there, if you might not can see it, but it says, Barry and friends serving time. God bless you all. Just trust in God. Leonard Skinner, Johnny Van Zant. And then Joe, our friend Jojo Billingsley that we became friends with. Jojo is right here. And she says, to Barry and Joanne and friends, thank you so much for your love and support. God bless. JoJo Billingsley, original Leonard Skinner band. And over here is uh, me and uh, Donnie Van Zant in front of his tour bus. Spent a little time with him there. And uh, Donnie Van Zant uh, says on there, Barry and his friends serving time. Keep the faith. Hope to see you soon. God bless. Donnie Van Zant. So... That's the free bird room, and we'll be taking all this down here just in a little bit to pack it up, as I said, and uh, take it into uh, Branchville Correctional Facility this time. And we're so privileged to have uh, Jane to go with us. And, uh, you know, it's going to be a real honor for the men there. And, Jane, 
Do you have anything else to say? I uh, just want to say it's an honor to be here and it's an honor to be in this room and say the love and the support that Barry has for the family and what he's doing with the love and the music and helping the guys out and everything and I feel very honored to be here. Well, thank you and we're glad to be here. And before you turn that off, I want you to swing around. We missed the Leonard Skinner guitar that was sent to us by Tim Lindsay, the bass player for Molly Hatchet sent us this guitar uh, with the uh, instructions that he wanted to, us to have this to be able to display it into the, uh, the prisons and the jails as well. And so that was a real special treat to receive from Tim Lindsay. So there we go. We're going to start packing up here. So greetings to all. God bless.